A client shares with the counseling dietitian that they have lately been feeling stressed about implementing changes. Which of the following is an example of a probing counselor response? A. Can you tell me more about what specifically is causing your stress? B. It sounds like you're carrying a heavy load right now. C. I know it can be challenging. No worries. Everything will work out. D. If you're feeling stressed, then you're probably not trying hard enough to relax. Okay, let's first highlight our key words. So we'll highlight client, counseling, feeling stressed, probing, counselor response. All right, let's start with A. So this definitely sounds like a probing counselor response. We're delving deeper into what exactly is causing the patient's stress. We're trying to get them to open up and give more information. And information is the foundation for how we can help the client. So this definitely looks like a probing counselor response. Let's pocket it and move on to B. All right, so with B, it sounds like a reflective listening response because it's basically just paraphrasing what the client already shared by saying they're stressed. And the phrase is saying, it sounds like you're carrying a heavy load right now. Heavy load, stress, same type of thing. So you're just paraphrasing it for the client to really just make them feel like they're being heard and you're establishing that rapport. But it is not an example of a probing response so we can eliminate it how about c well c is definitely a reassuring response because it's just saying hey relax no worries everything is going to work out again not something that you want to rely on because it's not really producing any type of productive game plan for the patient and it's definitely not a probing response because it's not opening up any further communication about the issue. So it's not a probing response. We can eliminate it. How about D? So this definitely sounds like a hostile response because you're basically saying, hey, patient, you know what? You're stressed. That's on you. And you're just not doing enough to not be stressed. Definitely not something you want to tell the patient. And it's definitely not an example of a probing response because you're not digging deeper at all. You're really just closing off communication. We can eliminate this answer choice. That leaves us with A, and that is indeed the correct answer.